All right, well, I'm attempting to fix this fender. Now, I don't want to fix it like, you know, you think you'd want it fixed. I just want to tack this up so it's structural. So, I'm going to tack a little here and then pound that down and work my way around. Uh, we'll see how it comes. This stuff's like paper right here. I ain't good at welding paper. So you give me some thick metal, I'll lay a bead, but this stuff we'll see how it comes out. Oh I'll show you guys what I'm looking at. I mean, it's, I don't know, here, well, body says paper thin, and then it's all rusty. It could be and everything, so it's just popping away, but I don't know. We're slow. We got this spot kind of tacked up. That kept blowing bigger and bigger, so I went off. All this, I started tacking, and just started blowing out. Up here, I was doing pretty good, and then all of a sudden, poof, that big hole was there. So, and then we got all this gap. I mean, you almost stick your finger through there. Well, I'm gonna pound it around and see what happens. Oh, uh -oh. we'll get it eventually, one way or another. All right, let's see here. start doing body work for a living. Take your foot. Real nice right there. Use a whole spool of wire on this fender. I'm gonna get it. It's not bleeding too far down on this side. A little touch up, but not too bad. That sounds pretty good. A little touch ups look good. A few big holes I've blown, but those are uh, ventilation holes. You know, I get going fast, it'll flow the air through better. So those are fine. We just need structural. We're almost there. Uh, Welding all this gap up. Closing up. Long ways to go though. Clean her up a little more. Alright. Give you guys an update of the most beautiful weld you ever seen. I don't know. It's pretty bad. But I got tacked, tacked, and that was well, and I blew that out and that out. I got that welded up. Now I'm working from the bottom slowly building on that weld each time working my way up then i'll get up start filling these in and those i don't know what else to do uh, you weld thin ass rusted metal i probably I don't know, other guys probably do it great so but there's professional welders out there up and done now before i show it to you it might look a little ugly but a hey, perfect ain't what i'm going for i'm going for classic you know i'm just trying to make it so people don't get cut on it and it don't get crack out any worse and i think i've done got that so i tacked it all up everywhere and hit a little sanding disc real quick knocked the highs off it 
and you rub your hand all around it, you're good to go. You can't cut yourself nothing. So that should be perfect. We'll put a clear coat over that. I don't want to paint it. You know, make that all perfect. Make the rest of the look, rig not look good. So, <clears throat> you know, that being all messed up, that makes the rig look good. So that's what we're going for. All right. We'll see you on the next part here. Y'all have a good day.